Hello, everyone. Do you know what time it is? It's Dark Souls 2 o'clock. Time to play some more. And I learned something new. I did look online for this. Again, full disclosure. But I think it's fair enough that I did, because... Well. Remember I couldn't figure out how to level up? I looked up how to level up. It's not some grand secret. And I'm pretty certain that it's not supposed to be some sort of a mystery that you're supposed to find out on your own. I'm pretty sure in an RPG, you're supposed to know how to level up. The manual is particularly unhelpful, but yes, it's it's quite simple. You just go back to the the main place. Ma, what the hell's his name? Let's find it. Majula. So let's go back. So yes, apparently this is where you level up. I'm not sure if I just use this bonfire or if I have to speak to her. I think I might have to speak to her. Yeah. Seek those whose names are unutterable. The four endowed with immense souls. Their souls will serve as beacons. Once you have found them, return here to me so that hope will not fade away. Yes, yeah, so if I had kept talking to her, I guess I would have seen that I'm supposed to return to her. Although I don't actually remember her being here. The first time I saw her, she was over by the cliff next to that tree, right? I'm not exactly sure when she moved to here. But anyway. Is that a shard you found? <gasps> yes. Here. Yes. Let me see it. Yes, 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 yes. So that I may help you. The Estus Flask, please, please, dear God, yes. To see light. To see hope, however faint it might be. Upgrade Estes Flask, yes. I'm not sure why they didn't just mention go back to Majul in the manual or something. I don't think it's supposed to be hard. Alright. Give Estes Flask shard, absolutely. What else am I going to do with it? Sweet, I'm guessing that gives me one more Estus Flask. I can't do it again, can I? Wait, do I have another one? Hold on, do I have two shards? I do have two Estus Flasks. Keep fumbling over the menu. Still getting used to the controls. I don't remember what it looked like. No, I don't have another one, so why is that an option? Bearer of the curse. Seek souls. Larger, more powerful souls. Seek the king. That is the only way. Lest this land swallow you whole. As it has so many others. I really like the slow and deliberate and sort of poetic way all the characters talk. It feels very strange, surreal. I like it. Okay, I don't actually have one. You don't. Okay, so it shows you the menu option even though you don't have it. it should be grayed out or something. Oh, wait. That's right! I need to go get my souls. Where is it? Here? Oh wait, it's down. Yeah. This is down, isn't it? Yeah. Or is it? Yeah, I think it is. Don't think it was this way. This is locked, right? Yep, doesn't open from this side.
Somebody saw me, right? Yep, someone's coming. Come on. I think that's the axe dude, right? <laughs> no, sword and shield guy. Get him both. Yep. Yeah. See if I can go slowly and backstab him. Apparently I can. Sweet. One, two, and three. Let's see if that giant gi gigantic bird comes back. Just shot an arrow at me. Where the hell did that come from? Oh god. Alright, I should be able to get my souls back. Just gotta get on this damn thing again. It seems like you have to sprint to jump. Which is really strange. Yeah, I'm not really sure if that's how you do a plunging attack. It didn't seem to do any more damage than normal. So I'm thinking I did it wrong. Here's my souls. I'm gonna get them and I'm gonna run. Okay, now it's time to level up. I've also got a bunch of souls that I can use to get me even more souls. Souls of a loss to this, souls of a loss to that. Let's go ahead and use them. Not all of them, I suppose. Let's see how much this gives me. Leave. What does leave do? I'm thinking back to the smooth and silky stone and how I tried to give it to the bird's nest, or the bird's nest creatures, the invisible bird nest creatures, whatever the hell they were. I wonder if I could have done this. Anyway, let's use it. Alright, how much is that going to give me? 200 souls? Alright, I guess I'll use them all. Crush those souls. Yeah. Pretty sure these are more significant. Probably give me a lot more. I'll just use these for now, though. I think it's good to have some of those souls just in reserve, just in case you, you kind of need to do something. Like, let's say you find a weapon, and you need to upgrade one of your stats that you didn't know you needed to upgrade for the weapon. So if you have some souls in reserve, you can kind of crush them and maybe be able to use something once you realize you actually need to use it, or want to use it. So I think I'll save them. Oops. Bearer of the curse. Seek, seek, lest this... All right. 
Time to level up. How does this work? Oh, so each level increases one stat by one? I see. Okay, so I can level up how many times? Four times? One, two, three, four. Four times. Sweet. Right. So this is going to upgrade my hit points by a significant amount. Looks like it's pretty much all it's going to do for the most part. Endurance gives me a bit more stamina. That's nice. And more health. Vitality. This allows me to hold a lot more equipment. I'm not sure if that's a problem for me at the moment. I'm not sure what that is. Casting speed. Okay, that's some sort of a magic thing. Strength gives me more attack and a little bit more health. Doesn't really increase my attack by that much. Now, dexterity, I'm pretty sure I really want. Because I kind of want to be more of a dexterity focused person, I think. Also gives me more defense. Eventually. Gotta upgrade it a couple times to get that. I'm liking that. Uh, a bit more health, more resistance against various things. Intelligence, don't think that matters for me, it's more magic based. Faith, also more magic based. I'm surprised Dexterity doesn't give you more stamina. But stamina is very important. So let's upgrade that twice. Upgrade Dexterity. And do I want a bit more health? I certainly would like it. But I'm pretty sure I don't need that to use equipment. Whereas Dexterity I might. Same with Strength. Wait, did I already use all four? Oh, I did already use all four. Vitality? I feel like I should put more into Dexterity. I really feel like I should. I do a bit more damage with it. Yeah, I'm going to put another into Dexterity. Okay. Sweet. I feel a lot better now that I know how to level up. Also... Also... I never explored around here. I came from up there, so what's around here? I was thinking that key that I could buy from that... Uh, Pack Mule Woman. <laughs> That's what I'm going to call her, Pack Mule Woman, because I don't remember her name. Might be able to be spent up here. Oh, who are you? Uh, oh. oh hello there. W welcome to my uh, shop. I'm Morlin. And I, well, I sell armor. Oh, sorry, I... Please do have a look at my wares. I could really use the business. If you'd be so kind. What, you don't get too many customers out here? How surprising. Of course, I can't afford anything. Pretty sure that's what I already have. There's gotta be a way to compare these against what I already have equipped, right? But I don't see it. I mean, it'd be absurd if you couldn't. Yeah, I can't afford anything. Let's have a chat. I came from the west, from Volgan. Have you been there? It's a lively place, vibrant with trade. Very competitive, of course. And you have to grease the wheels to get anywhere. But I didn't have the funding for that, so I left home in hopes of striking gold. It's been years since then, and I've... <laughs> well, I've made very little headway. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know why I'm still here. Everything's all run down and dying. It's t terrible for business, really. 
A group calling themselves the Blue Sentinels have gained much power in Volgan. You can't even run a shop without their blessing. They claim to be working for the greater good, but oh, it's absolute hogwash. Well I, I well I do hope I see you again. Ooh, it's up here. And also, why do so many people die here? <laughs> what were they fighting in here? They didn't try to attack him, did they? Is there something up here? I probably should read this message, huh? Chest ahead. I guess he won't mind if I open it up. Kind of feel like I'm stealing from him, but he doesn't seem to care. Titanite shard. Yeah, I have no idea what killed those people. What the hell is this? Uh. <laughs> um. <laughs> I see lots of goodies. I also see lots of death. Let me guess, you died by falling. <laughs> yep. Ring required ahead, therefore merchant. Ring required to go down? What kind of a ring? Is there some sort of a fall damage ring? Okay, so I think it's too far to fall down at the moment. Therefore, merchant. So is there a ring I can buy from a merchant? Perhaps. Perhaps, perhaps. God, this game is beautiful. Look at that view. seen Titanite shards in the original Dark Souls. I don't remember precisely what they're used for. I think they're upgrading weapons or something of the sort. <gasps> oh! Is it a cat? A huge cat? Some sort of an animal. What are you doing? Oh. Undead, are we? And one without much time remaining. Just about ready to fall apart, I'd say. Not exactly the time to be chatting with a cat. <laughs> <laughs> well, suit yourself. Oh yes, you may call me Shalqua. Enchante. So, what did you want anyway? Ooh, you smell wonderful. <laughs> Pretty sure I smell like... Like rotting meat. Covenants. No covenants joined. Abandoned covenant? I'm not even in a covenant. What do you have? Maybe you're the merchant with the ring? Mmm, rings. Okay. What have you got? Homeward bone, prism, mm-hmm. Lure certain types of enemies. Blocks Estus recovery within a limited area. That's weird. Absorbs HP from each defeated foe. Whoa, that sounds really good. Ah, reduces damage from falling. 13,000 souls. Yeah, okay, I'll buy that. Um, never. Easier to be detected by enemies, that does not seem like a good thing. Easier to connect to players who choose the same god. Can hear the voices of foes. Some creepy items. 
Nothing suited you, I presume? Well, that's dismaying. <laughs> A little too rich for my blood. I don't even think I have blood. But if I did, it would be too rich for it. <laughs> What's happened to you? You have that glint in your eyes. And the scent of one with quite the catalogue of sins. Oh, don't feel bad. I'm sure your mother's still proud. <laughs> this place is already dead. Everything will crumble and waste away so that something new may be born. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> oh, yes, glorious. Nothing suited you, I presume. What the hell are those? Those are disgusting. Also, they seem to have a shit ton of hit points. They also do a ton of damage, even though they're tiny. These little shits are going to kill me. seem to be doing, like, no damage to them. They also give me practically no souls. That is really bizarre. Cracked red eye orb. What does that do? Invade other worlds. No thanks. Something else I wanted to check out. The Titanite Shard. What does that look like? Is it even in this section? It is not. Where is it? Is it that? Yes, reinforces equipment. Use to reinforce equipment, reinforce equipment up to plus three, okay. Need to find an armor smith or something of the sort. Ah, right. It's broken. I broke it. Wonderful. It's locked. That actually might be the smith's house. But the key unlocks. Perhaps. Try attacking. What, the well? Oh! Ew. God, I love Dark Souls. All these little secrets just hidden here. Estus Flask Shard, yes! Yes, three Estus Flasks! That makes me extremely happy. <laughs> All these people died to pigs. Little rotting pigs. Poor, poor person.
Alright, what's up here and what's down here? Let's go up first. Perhaps it's just a beautiful view? Despair ahead. <laughs> Be wary of overwhelming, in short, tough enemy. What? Five homeward bones. I'm a little bit worried that there's some horrible things here. But look at that view. Beautiful. Neil. Uh... Okay, given the messages and the bloodstains... Well, that person just fell off. They didn't die to an enemy. That one did. It's a shame you can't see the enemy. Neil. Eh, what have I got to lose? Enter Covenant. Vicar Stone. Offer Austone. I don't think I have one. Right, I'm going to say no to that. I don't know what that does, and it creeps me out. I know I can join Covenants, and they do various things, but I don't know what. Visions of saint, but wretch. <laughs> okay. Oh, is this another Covenant place? Liar ahead. Weakness rear. Hmm, something in there. Contraption does not move. Wait a minute, wasn't there an item I could buy that opened a contraption somewhere? I remember it said, like, would open something's, somebody's contraption. Might be what that is. Hidden path ahead. Just bashing the wall to see if there's anything here. Crimson Barma? Is that a shield? Also sounds like a delicious casserole. Hmm. Can I use it? Yes, I can. Is it in any way better than what I have? No, it's not. Tough enemy hit. Okay. Lever. Eh, let's pull it, see what happens. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Seem safe? I switched my life gems. I actually should have refilled my Estus flasks before coming down here. Did that just close behind me? Fuck me. That's not good. Pull. Oh wait, does that open it? Or does that open the next one? Oh, okay. That's fine. Soul, broken thief sword. Can't open this, can I? Nope. 
still waiting for that tough enemy. Whoa. Where's this coming out? Whoa. I see a lot of blood stains. Holy shit. Gorgeous view. No kidding. Gorgeous view ahead. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Weakness. Weapon. I'm gonna rate that one up. That's a good tip. Everybody should read that. Bonfire ahead, but giant ahead. Right ahead bonfire. Perhaps I can and should run to it. He's gonna pound me into the ground, into dust. Oh, fuck. Bonfire. Bonfire. Where's bonfire? Oh god, there's two. Ah. Yeah, okay. Wait a minute, I did a ton of damage to it. Okay, um, I appear to have one hit point. Oh, fuck, there's another giant. I shouldn't use my life gems. A waste. I'm gonna die. <laughs> yeah. There's no way I can take on two at one time. I might be able to take on one. Maybe. Anyway, I'm just gonna upgrade my Estus flask. Is that a shard you here mm -hmm. to see light, however faint? Three Estus flasks, hell yes. Wasn't using a broken weapon, was I? Wasn't really paying attention. Right, do I need to visit an armor smith or a weapon smith to fix my item? I think I might. I think I kind of screwed up by letting that get broken. All right. Well, I've got three Estus flasks. Flasks. I'm gonna try one of them one more time. I feel like I shouldn't go here yet. Yeah, because their weapons have such a long range, I think what I need to do is actually dodge sideways instead of forwards. Or, uh, instead of backwards. Because I just have to dodge, I just have to move too much backwards to get out of reach of their weapon. Which means I need to dodge at the right time, because if you dodge too early, then they readjust and they end up hitting me anyway, even if I dodge to the side. So sideways is pretty much what I have to do, but to do that, I only have to be, I have to be fighting one. I can't really do that with two. Also, I wonder how useful my shield would be here. Let's find out. <laughs> oh, fuck me. <laughs> 
surprisingly useful. It actually blocked almost all of it. However, there's a bit of a knockback. Right, I said one more time, but I mean... When I say one more time, I mean one more good shot. One more satisfying attempt. Not... which does not include being pushed off an edge with the first attack. I don't know, it just felt like using my shield would be pointless because their weapons are so big, but evidently not. And I wonder if I can actually, like, parry their attack, or whatever it's called. Oh! I can do this! The sideways dodge works. What am I going to find out here, though? I wonder. It feels like the other way I was going was kind of the main way you're supposed to go. But... I actually want to keep trying this. I said one more try, but no, forget that. I can do this. There's two more things I'd like to know, though. And that's, can I do this? If I time it right, can I... Like, parry their attack? counter it and make them weak. Also, I want to know how viable using the shield is. Because I didn't actually use it that time, I just tried to dodge. And if I'm not using my shield, then I might as well not even have it. I might as well put a weapon in my other hand. It's, it's pointless. so close. One more good hit, I think, would have done it. Yeah, I'm running out of stamina. Stamina's really damn important. Man, it's such a long trek back there. Somebody did say there was a bonfire. Perhaps I should run and just try to find the bonfire. Hmm. I mean, usually running is a pretty bad idea. But, I won't know unless I try. So I'm going to try it.
Okay, I see giant after giant after giant after giant. Somebody said bonfire on right. Oh my god, there's so many giants. I really need to learn how to fight them. They're not bosses. They're standard enemies. On right. That one just fell to its death. And I just got its souls. Thank you. Green Blossom. It's probably a boss fight, isn't it? I have a feeling... Oh my god, what have I done? Okay. Fair enough. That wasn't a bonfire. I'm going back to where I was before. I don't like that place. Everybody's too big for my liking. Which way? Down? Down. Missed on my targeting there. supposed to be a backstab. Didn't work out that way. I know you're coming. Shit. Fuck that up. All right, where did I get attacked from before? Oh yes, from in there. Okay.
Come and get me. Yes, you can climb ladders, right? Oh, maybe not. Well, I've put myself in a rather bad position here, haven't I? Can't exactly climb down without getting attacked. I guess these ones can't climb. Or they just don't feel like it. Let's see if they get bored and go back. Jesus! Someone's got a quick stab. Oh god, there's more. There's a lot more. Come on. Let me try equipping some explosives. If I can actually remember how to do that. No, not that. Stupid directional pad. Magic damage? Do a firebomb. Throw that in there, and let's throw this in there. Since I'm going with damage for that slot, I should put my throwing knives in there. There we go, so the bottom is for the healing, and the top... Wait. Wait, what? If that goes here, then what goes in the top slot? I don't understand. I don't know, maybe it's arrows or something. Let's try this thing. Well, that's fancy. Didn't do anything, though. Right, so are these going to fire again? No? I feel like a bunch of people are holding guns to my head right now. Blue wooden shield. Hmm, not bad. It's fairly light. It's got pretty good stats. It's not nearly as good as the one I'm using, though. If I compare it against it. Mm, yep, it protects a lot... Less. It's lighter, but that, I don't think that really matters. How do I tell my current weight? Like, I know I can look at my maximum weight, but what about what I'm currently carrying? Oh, is that 58 out of 60? So I'm not quite overburdened? I think that's what that means. No, no, that's not what that means. I'm not looking at the right thing. Player's Dennis? Where's my current weight? Is it the bottom right? 31 out of... 31.3? I can't seem to move the help thing over there. What's, what's the stuff in the bottom right? It's a 65.9%. I have no idea. Another one of the mysteries of this game. Cool. Be really hard to time that, but I suppose if I could time it right, I could do some damage to something. Hmm. Is there a safe way down there? 
Yes. Look safe. Uh. Okay. Not so safe. Well, at least there actually is something in it. What the fuck is that? Oh my god. That is horrifying. <laughs> Jesus. Examine. No Ferris's lockstone in inventory. Oh, that's the lockstone thing. Ferris's contraption. Okay, now I want it. If I can remember where to buy it. Why didn't back get like the witch's house? <laughs> Just ahead. Doesn't open from the side. Okay. Holy shit, that's a big dude. Okay, he might be the one I want to get in here. Also, are you an enemy? No, you're not. Hello there. Traveling all alone in these treacherous times. Well, I hope you have a very good reason. Oh, hogwash. Who am I to judge? <laughs> My name is Pate. I journey hither and thither on a sort of treasure hunt, you might call it. Be careful out there. There's talk of unsavory bandits who prey upon travelers like yourself. I'm really not too worried about bandits at this point. Oh yes, you be cautious if you go any farther. There's treasure in there for certain, but the entrance locks from behind. Oh. I saw the same design earlier, and it's the same contraption, I'm sure. I was with this warrior, you see, and he insisted that he go inside first. <laughs> the rather brusque fellow tried to swipe the loot for himself, but it trapped him inside. I still have the gent's ring. I do hope he wasn't harmed. Try luring it out, and then destroy. I just see a couple normal enemies. The only thing I think that could maybe be need to be lured out would be this massive thing. Any more pearls of wisdom? I'll leave this one to you. I'm worried about what might be inside. So am I. The thing looks like a turtle. Ah, hello, asshole. Ow. Gee, what the fuck? I thought explosive barrels barrels were supposed to be red. <laughs> okay, now I know. Well, apparently that guy throwing those things up there doesn't give a shit about his turtley friend. Bit of a dick.
Come on. Oh, I think I finally killed whoever it was that chases me. It seems like the more you do areas, the more and more enemies disappear. No, Jesus. Oh, that didn't work. I'm trying to do the parry thing. What the hell was that? What the hell? What are you doing up there? And what are you doing? <laughs> Somebody's stuck. Aww. I'm trying to remember how to jump. It's sprint plus that. There we go. Oh, I see. They're manning all of those. Bastard sword? That sounds like it could be good. Check it out. I'm certainly lacking for swords. No doubt about that. Let's get rid of this piece of shit broken thing. Bastard sword. Hmm. Wait, well, you can use a bastard sword one-handed. Ooh, it's really, 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 really heavy. Hmm. Yeah, it needs a shit ton of strength. Way more than I have. Kind of a seed in action, though. <laughs> yeah, I shouldn't exactly be using that. Okay. This directional pad is a piece of crap, but it almost never goes where I want it to. Why does it keep doing that? I think it might be partially broken. I seriously think my directional pad might be broken. That or they're just all horribly designed. This broken straight sword is shit. Yellow quartz long sword, I guess? Yeah, I'll toss that in there. Thing looks kind of hideous. I'll give it a go.
Alright, well I need my damn souls, but if I go out there I might get blown up. So... Hmm... How do I just, like, throw this on the ground? Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm just going to get it. There really is nothing in these ever, is there? Hurrah for rear. What? Oh, it's saying look behind. <laughs> oh, that's that's a, like a humanoid figure. But made out of a tree. Large soul. Oh, God damn it. That thing's creepy. Alas, nothing happened. Someone did say the trees sprouted from giants, right? Could run to the other side, I suppose. Alright, so yeah, it does use up my sword to actually hit these things, so I definitely should not be doing that. Ooh, a crossbow. Mm, but don't I need bolts? Pretty sure I do. 